This year's Bloomsburg Fair touts more than a thousand vendors, free entertainment, exhibits, and more. Newswatch 16's Nikki Cries. She is our correspondent live at the fairgrounds to tell us all about the new attractions this year. <laughs> Nikki. Live at the fair once again, Scott and Lisa. Well, this year's Bloomsburg Fair features everything from a strolling mime to a fishing pond. There are a lot of new attractions here at the fair, and they are family friendly, all of them. While walking around the Bloomsburg Fair, it's easy to spot the longtime vendors, but there are a lot of new foods and attractions at this year's fair. There are 89 new vendors to be exact, which is more than double what there normally is. The fair says COVID kept many of the usual vendors away. Wild World of Animals is one of the new attractions. It's a very educational and entertaining experience. Grant Kemmerer is in charge of the show, which runs three times a day. It's a very fast paced show with all different types of animals. I mean, you're going to see reptiles, birds, mammals. If I'm showing you an animal and you're like, eh, give it two minutes and you'll be looking at something new. If wild animals aren't your thing, Texas Tommy Showtime also runs three times a day. The Western theme show is a hit with the kids. We do a lot of fun stuff. We do lassoing, we do whips. We have a special guest, four legged, in the show. Another fun and free activity for kids of all ages is first bite fishing. Let the little kids go fishing. It's educational, it's informational. It's fun. There are nearly 200 pounds of fish in this pool. First bite fishing is catch and release. Yeah. Every day at the fair from 1 to 4 and then from 5 to 9. And of course, there is all of the entertainment on the free stage, the animals, and the exhibition building, so you will never be bored or hungry here at the Bloomsburg Fair. Nikki Cries, Newswatch 16, live at the Bloomsburg Fairgrounds. Looks like a lot of fun.